Here are three tips for succeeding as a WGU, that is Western Governors University student, regardless of which program that you're in. Tip one is to set aside dedicated time to study. One of the things about the self-paced learning of WGU is that depending on someone's self-motivation level, the coursework can either go like a breeze and they will just be very consistent naturally, or maybe their natural baseline is to be more flexible and maybe have things creep up when it, things are getting closer to the end of the six month term. I think the best way to go about this self-paced learning is to, of course, make it adaptable based on your schedule. Let's say you're working full time, maybe you're doing other things that are large time commitments. The beauty of WGU is that you can schedule everything around that and adapt your coursework to that. But that said, I think it helps nonetheless to have some sort of scheduled study time dedicated for you to do that. Tip number two is to tell friends and family, especially people that you live with, about when you're going to be taking exams, what you're up to for your coursework. This is not only good for having a level of support from people you trust, but also just practically it's important because when you take a lot of objective assessments through the WGU learning management system, you actually need to be in a very quiet room. And if there's a lot of background noise or people just talking or yelling or laughing, that can actually be detrimental and potentially even lead the proctor of your exam to say, hey, this is not a good environment for this. We'll have to reschedule. That hasn't happened to me personally, but I can see that happening if someone's not in a quiet space. So a third tip beyond those two is taking the effort to get your LinkedIn profile and everything good and tied to that is to be networking throughout your degree program. Whether you're doing a bachelor's, master's at WGU or certificate, since it's online, there aren't a lot of inherent opportunities to network with fellow students and instructors. You really have to be intentional about doing that. And this is something that I actually want to get even better at. I've tried to be networking with course instructors on LinkedIn and fellow students and alumni, but I need to get better at that. And I think being intentional about that can help set us up for success. So good luck with your program. If you have any questions, let me know. I reply to every comment and thanks for watching.